I saw this on my homepage, man. Duke Dennis tells story time of him feeling uncomfortable after an awkward massage. <laughs> I ain't gonna lie, chat, bro. I ain't gonna lie, fellas. I ain't gonna lie. I got a massage the other day, man. Mm. I got a massage the other day, man. And okay. I ain't gonna count. Mm -hmm. I don't think that I felt a little violated. Oh, what in the Deshaun Watson is going on here? He felt violated after a massage? I think I think a lot of have misconceptions about massages and let me set the record straight okay just in case there's any confusion a massage consists of you undressing to however which level you feel you could dead ass have a massage with your clothes on all right you could dead ass have a massage with your clothes on but you obviously can't take your boxers off all right massages are actually helpful for muscle recovery and they feel great afterwards sometimes it's painful in the moment but it always feels great afterwards man i promise just get one, try one. But don't go to one of those like dinky spots though. Go to an official spot. I felt a little violated, man. You know what I'm saying? After a long day, I decided that I'm gonna go get me a massage. And that's what I did. But first I went and stopped and got me some Popeyes. I went and got me some Popeyes before Good. I went to, the, to get the massage. And usually, you know what I'm saying? When I go get massages, mm -hmm. I, I, I get the 90 minute thing. You know what I'm saying? Me too. I, me too. I, I don't feel like the six, the hour the hour one is good enough for me. I like to go get the ninety minute thing. Me too. Me too. You me too. You know what I'm saying? And and you know after I ate my Popeyes, I walked in there and I know I was smelling like fried chicken and and and, and, and if they wanted to judge me, then then they, that's their business at the end of the day. <laughs> but it's like you know what I'm saying? I had to eat first before I go in there and lay down. And I don't know, man. Like. This wait. is my first time trying. Wait, wait, wait. Does fried chicken have a scent? Like, can somebody tell me? If someone walked past me right now, they could be like, oh, this nigga smells like subs. Like, he just ate a fucking Cajun sub. Y'all could smell fried. Does my nose suck? What? No, ain't no fucking way. Oh, y'all. I'm not the only nigga that can't smell fried food. Shut the fuck up. Man, shut up. Can you smell food on other people? Like, after they yeah. eat? Yeah. Can you smell, if I ate fried chicken, you'd be able to smell that on me? I got a strong nose, though. Yeah, but I'm saying, like, if I ate fried chicken, for example, would you be able to smell that? Yeah. And a little new, a little new massage parlor, so I was a little skeptical. But anyways, you know what I'm saying? I prance on in there, and, you know, I lay down, and I ain't gonna lie, it was just a little different. Like, you know, I lay, I take, I, I strip, I take, I take all my little clothes off, um... I take out my clothes off, chat, and, and I... Hey, I got you a zen for Christmas, Dirk. You're gonna need it, buddy. I lay down face first with nothing but my drawers on. And, you know what I'm saying? The, the lady come in there, and <laughs> she, she start to do the little thing. You know what I'm saying? She start to do the little thing, and she start, you know what I'm saying, massaging me and whatever the case may be. And I can see a lot of y'all young. Y'all never had no massage, but... Thank you! Thank you, bro. I'm telling you, but y'all be making shit weird when it's not weird. Hey, just that guy. Appreciate it two months, man. Whenever you get a massage, you go on there, you strip. Ever get a massage by a man? Yes. Yes, I have two main massage people. One is a woman, one is a man. You leave your drawers on. You know what I'm saying? The women, they females get to take they, all their clothes off, but we got to keep what? our drawers on. Uh, I can see a lot of y'all never had massages um, before, and it's cool, but y'all showing y'all age right now. Wait, why? Why, why do they get to? What the fuck? Nah, that's not even fair. Hey, hey, what happened to equality, bro? I missed that shit. Man, equality, it was such a beautiful thing when we had it previously. Bro, you mean to tell me I had to keep my shit on? If you eat chicken, you get the grease on her hands, lips, breathe, and whatever you touch. Wash so your hands. So it's easy to pick up a smell, buddy. I'm not saying I, I want to have my dick out. I'm just saying that, like, Never mind. Never mind. All right, bro, you got it. Never mind. My fault. Yeah. Um. But anyways, though, you know she she doing her due diligence. She in there massaging me up and, and things of that. And she whispered to me. She say she say oh oil oh, hey sir sir oil oh, you want oil oh, ten dollar oil oh, ten dollar yeah. Oh, he went to one of those spots. Damn, is that an L assumption? 
Did we just get Duke ASMR? There's so many things going through my brain. <laughs> Hey, bitch, you were hey, Mafia, you appreciate the subs. Hey, 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 clip this audio. Someone receive Caleb. Someone, bro, please clip this audio and send this bitch to me, bro. I'm gonna use it. So I don't know how I'm gonna use it, but I'm gonna figure out a way to make use of this shit. And she whispered to me, she say, she say, oh, oil, oh, hey, sir, sir. And I'll be like, I was like, who? <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I say, what? What? I say, yes. I say, I say, yes. I don't think I've ever heard Duke whisper. That was my first time. That's insane. Huh. <laughs> Niggas. <laughs> hey, SX, appreciate the sub, man. Welcome back. I would love oil for $10. Yes, I would love oil for $10. 10 is a scam, though. You heard me? So 10 is a scam. She take uh, a man or two to go get the oil. You know what I'm saying? And when she come back, um, oh, she, she, put the, she, she put it on me. She put it on me, but I ain't gonna lie. I felt her like she put way too much oil on me that she. I hate. To put I on hate me. that man. And I was at first. I'm like, you know, whatever. I'm gonna mind my business. Also, you know what I'm saying. When you when you when you lay down, you 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 and you strip. You leave your drawers on. You leave the drawers on so that when they pull the sheet down, they can tuck the they can tuck. They can tuck the sheet in your drawers and they pull them halfway down your ass. What? Not all the way. They don't, they don't pull your pants down. They like they like tuck the sheet in your drawers and pull them halfway down so you have your ass hanging out. Yo, I did not know that. That's news to me. I've never had nobody pull my fucking shit down. <laughs> hey, hey, I got to get a referral. Where he be going, man? I got to know where the fuck he is. They can say he's a victim. <laughs> No, they definitely tuck the sheets. They definitely tuck the sheets in your in your fucking boxes. Facts they do. But I've never had them pull it all the way down. I've been to about 12 massage spots, 10 to 12 massage spots, all different types, Korean spots. I've been to ones at the gym. I've been to independent locations. I've been to like franchise locations. Man, never. I've had men, women. I had all types of people. I've never in my life had them pull my boxers halfway down without me asking for it. And I've never asked for it. Basically. You know what they do, basically. And so, um, that's what they do. That's what this they sounds, do. This sounds like an Asian massage parlor in Miami that got swatted, LMAO. They swatted a massage parlor? Why would they do that? Like, what would he, what, I, humans, man, fucking crazy. I went to, I went to like an Asian spot when I was in Vegas, uh, cause I desperately needed a massage. I was so sore before the fucking phase football matchup. Um, and they still didn't do that. Mm -mm. But, um, Anyway, when she pulled the oil on me, I'm like, that's a lot of oil, low key. But I'm gonna mind my business. They were sex you know, workers. I'm gonna mind my business. <laughs> they did that you at know hate. What I'm so that's she hateful. Getting, you know fuck. what I'm saying? Rubbing me with the oil, and she like, she like, it feel good. It's oh, good. you mean like a swat? Oh, like a raid? Oh, I thought you meant they got swatted like a streamer gets swatted, like a fake call. Oh, oh. <laughs> Oh damn! Okay, that makes more sense. I feel good, and I'm like, mm, oh, my business. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? So she get the, you know what I'm saying, rubbing me with the oil, and she like, she like, it feel good. Hey, so I feel good, and I'm like, mm -hmm, cause she talking too much. She chatting, she chatting. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I want to, I want to hear the music, the the, 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 the Japanese music. I want to hear it. Hey, Young Sean, thank you for the gift, Mary. I appreciate hear the it. And he chatting in my ear. You know what I'm saying? So, so anyways, she massaging me. You know what I'm saying? Uh -huh. She massaging me. And, but it was a lot of oil, so she was really going sliding on my back. She was sliding. <laughs> and then, and, but as she got towards my ass, like, she was, like, doing too much. She was doing way too much. And I was just like, bro, like, what the hell is going on? But I really wasn't saying too much. Cause I ain't gonna, you know what I'm saying, cause more problems. I ain't no, I ain't confrontational. I ain't no confrontational person. You know what I'm saying? If it ain't, if if, if it's doable, then that, then I do it. But you know, I was. She was. <laughs> this nigga in his chat. <laughs> Did she try and put her thumb in it with six exclamation marks? <laughs> 
Oh my god. I know the internet is the fucking best thing. It's the best thing that has ever happened. Hey, Dre, appreciate the two months. I can't believe he's listening to the story live and he's like, I just have to know. Like, let me just. <laughs> That's fucking awesome, man. It was on my ass, like she was rubbing my ass, like like she, I just didn't feel comfortable. The way she was just rubbing it and, and, and like, she was like, it's kind of like how I would be, she was rubbing ass like I would be rubbing ass if I was massage therapist parlor person. You know what I'm saying? That's how she was rubbing ass, like she was rubbing my ass, kind of how I would be rubbing you know what I'm saying? And I was like, bro, I was like, hold on, man. Ah, damn, man. Cause like she was like, <laughs> she was rubbing my shit and like, and like, like, usually they'll just go halfway, but like she was like coming down and like, she was like coming down and then she was going across. You don't go across. You don't go across no, no nigga ass now. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck. Fuck. You know, and that's what, <sighs> that right there is what kind of like threw me off a little bit. <laughs> that's she was going across. And since yeah. my ass was already oily, bro, <laughs> when she was going across, like my ass was kind of like spreading a little bit. <laughs> I ain't the victim. He's a 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 victim. She ain't feel right, bro. And I was just like, I was like, hey, hey. I was like, hey. You know what I'm saying? And I was just like, bro. And it was already a lot of oil on there, bro. And I don't know, bro. I just didn't feel right, bro. I was just like, bro, her ass tweaking. You know what I'm saying? Like, I don't know. I ain't like that, bro. It was way too much, bro. She was trying, like... She already pulled, you know what I'm saying? I, <laughs> I shouldn't laugh. <laughs> Nigga, Chessa, he, she violated the big drop. <laughs> <laughs>